bracelets upon thy head. We had bracelets. You know, we had the real gold. We had the gold. We had the old prayer, the sapphire. Go ahead. And a chain on thy neck. We had the chains on our neck. Some of our people do that now, but how do you think we was rocking back then? You feel what I'm saying? He got that. Go ahead. And I put a jewel on thy forehead. Go ahead. And earrings in thine ears. We had the finest earrings, the jewels, the jewels. We was decked down. We was decked down to the nines. You could drop that. But how are we living now? I think we're living pretty up there. Like, obviously we have issues, but like, it wasn't on for the I mean, we don't have gold chains. Of course. I'm saying like, are we our estate now as a nation? Are we high or are we low on the food chain of our nation? He has black people. So called black people. Uh, I don't know if it's things like it really depends on how you define the highest bow. I'm going to show you something. Go ahead. Limitations of the core in verse 17. As for us, our eyes. One second. You know what? Like, my perspective is like, I feel like black people have a nasty habit of comparing themselves to other groups. Right. Like, I feel like black people see success in terms of how the white man sees success. Right. Like, we don't see it as, oh, okay, so, yeah, the white man might have this house. He might have this car. But we we don't have the same thing. We have something maybe a little good, good for us. You know, it all depends on the person. I'm going to show you the reason why, though. You understand? Yeah, that's 100% true. But there's steps that led up to that. You feel what I'm saying? Let me get that. Book of Limitations. Chapter 4 and verse 17. Yeah. Oh, 4 and 1. How is the gold become dim? It says, how did the gold become dim? Gold is a very, something of rich value. But how did it become dim? Right? How did that value go from the top? Like I showed you, we was dig down in ornaments, chains, silver, gold. Now, we're wearing scrubs. Yeah. Now we're wearing fake jewelry. You understand? Now we're dim. You understand? Go ahead. How is the most fine gold Hey. It said the most fine gold is chain. We used to be very men of renown, yeah, yeah. valiant men. We were warriors, but now we're kind of subjective right now. Go ahead. The stones of the sanctuary are poured out in the top of every street. Go ahead. The precious sons of Zion. Because what? The, the precious, precious sons, sons of Zion. Zion. And brother, we are the precious sons of Zion. You understand? Go ahead. Comparable to fine gold. We were yeah. once comparable to fine gold. You understand? We were comparable to fine gold, but then we became dim. That's what it was talking about in the uh, 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 the first verse. Go ahead. How are they esteemed as earthen pitchers? You know what earthen pitchers are? Keep going. The work of the hands of the potter. The works of the hand of a potter. So somebody kind of crafting a oh, base like together. Art. Like an art. Yeah. We used to be fine gold where nobody can corrupt it, but now we can be shaped into anything. Now we can be shaped to following this, right. going into that, right. dealing with and this. That's because of like, I feel like a lot of that shit is the stuff that, you know, black people bring on themselves. All right, like, hey, look, 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 I'm glad you, you know, said that. Because in a sense, we oh, did bring it upon ourselves. Yeah. I'm going to show you why. Go ahead. This is the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28 and verse 15. Go ahead. But it shall come to pass, if thou will not hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy God, to observe, to do all his commandments and his statutes, which I command thee this day. So these people that we're going to read about, the Lord said, if you disobey me, I'm going to curse you. Yeah, I'm going to abandon you. Exactly. Curse, that's, that's a bad thing, obviously, right? You got it? Without God, without God. Why? Actually, no, you can drop it. You can uh, This is the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28, verse 16. Read right? it. Curse shall thou be in the city. God so says, curse will these people be in the city. Mm -hmm. What people live... Uh, on the, uh, the craziest earth of uh, uh, poverty, right? Not black people. Right? Homelessness, section 8, you understand? Struggling for the, the food. We, we need them, you understand? The food thing. Well, well, mostly I don't, but I know you know. But exactly, as a, as a, 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 a collection of people, a collection, we, we, we can take yeah, well, all We're always going to get a double. Right, exactly, go ahead. And curse shall thou be in the field. And who is cursing the field? so-called black and latino i don't know if we had the time but we had the so-called black and latino that was touching the cities and the field every hood you go you go see a poppy bull you know what i'm saying you go in every uh when you even go into the slave field right the uh the so-called uh natives and uh latinos they was in the uh city camp fields too they don't like to tell us but they were actually in the cotton fields prior to us 
one of them, they were slaving in the cotton fields. They start killing them off, then they came and got us from the Western Coast of Africa and uh, different places of the US. You understand? So, uh, actually, don't get hurt, um, you get hurt in 54. Let me 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 get hurt in This is the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28 and verse 54. Yeah. Yeah. So that the man that is tender among you, and very delicate, his eyes shall be evil toward his brother. It's that his eyes going to be evil towards his brother, right? What people on, on the face of the earth have an evil eye towards their own brother? I would say black. So we, we, we can't see how people don't see it. That's kind of a common thing in all these people. Like with Native Americans, if you know anything about Native Americans, it's right. Like they do be teaching that, okay, Native Americans, they were like these big, peaceful group they of were. people. They weren't. Right. They were violent. They were violent against yeah. each other. Yeah, they hated right. each other. You'll come to find out. Them. That the Israelites, the Israelites are indeed the so-called Blacks, Latinos, and Native Americans. Right. So what you just said proves the precept, right? Go ahead. And toward the white of his bosom. And who's known for disrespecting their women, pimping their women out, having their women whores and such in music videos? That's everybody. Damn. That's everybody. Which one of our people so-called be driving the boat? Huh? Who's the mega stallions of the world? Is that the white woman? Yeah. Well, Who's the Cardi B's of the world? Don't, is that remember, the, is that the uh, uh, remember, uh, Japanese Wait, wait, wait. Uh, what was the woman's name who was married to Kurt Cobain? Kurt Cobain? Kurt Cobain. No, 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 no. You know who I'm talking about, dude. I think the I white know who you're talking about, the white woman. Uh, I don't know her name, but I'm saying, on a high what level, what are you going to see her in the music video? Courtney? Probably, yeah. Courtney Love. Yeah, I think it was like Courtney Love. Courtney Love. Love. Uh, Madonna. Who is more predominant? Who is predominant? Who is predominant? Who is and towards the remnant yeah. of his children. Alright, go ahead. Which he shall leave. Who's not for leaving their children? That's plain to punch it. That, that went all three together. Right. So there was a so-called Japanese, Chinese, white woman. They would have to meet all three criteria. They didn't meet all three. You know, they kind of got chopped out of the thing. Right. right? The process of elimination, they kind of got exed out. Right? Now let me get back to this is the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28 and verse 68. Right. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again. So you know what the Israelites are doing in Egypt? No? Alright, go ahead. The Deuteronomy, chapter 6 and verse 8. 12. 12. Then beware, lest thou forget the Lord which brought thee forth out of the land of Egypt. Out of the land of Egypt. From the house of bondage. Out of the house of what? From the house of bondage. You know what the house of bondage is? You know what bondage is? Like being in chains. Being in chains, exactly. That's why when your man's locked up, you gotta pay what? Bail bond. Yeah. Right? To bond them out. They're in bondage. Right? So he said you're gonna be back into Egypt again. So it's just synonymous of bondage, slavery, being chained up. So he said he's gonna bring you back into Egypt again by what means? Whip shit! Right. With what? Whip shit! With what? Whip shit! Going into bondage again on ship. Oh, black. You had us during the time of the slave trade. You had the transatlantic yeah, slave trade. The Lord's going to bring us back to Egypt and bondage. The Lord sent us to Egypt and to bondage okay. on ship because of our disobedience. We disobeyed. We, we abandoned. disobeyed. We abandoned. So he said, okay, go over there. I'm a punisher. Yeah. You understand? Okay. Keep going. Right. 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 But the way we're up, I speak right. unto thee. Thou shalt see it no more again. Have we seen our homeland again? We don't even know where our homeland is. If I tell you to take a guess, what you gonna say? Where's our home? Right. right. But what country? You feel me? Look, it's, it's like that. Right? Thou shalt see it no more again. We don't want to go to Ethiopia. We don't want to go to Ethiopia. We don't want to go to Egypt. We don't want to go to Jamaica. And there, ye shall be sold unto your enemies. And then we're gonna be sold. So not just the slaves, and that's it. So you're going to be on these places and then you're going to be sold yeah. unto your enemies. Who are we sold to? White people. What did the Lord call them? The um, colonized people. I don't know. We call them our enemies. Do you agree with that today? Not really. How come? Well, okay. I, I, feel, like it, I feel like it depends. Well, like, yeah, well, if you're well, talking well, about the white well, level, well, as in, like, well, you know, well, the white upper class, you know, living in a nice mansion level, like, going to talk about that smack on Twitter about how. I support the minorities. I want to fight for civil justice. Meanwhile, they push, they support the very things in the system right. that actually hold black people back. So do you think like, that's I the, love mass, how, the vast um, majority, would you say? Talk about that. 
I'm not affected by that stuff. Because, like, if you're saying that black people are mostly affected by that stuff, I the book of Lamentations, chapter 4 and verse 3. Even the sea monsters draw out the breast. They give suck to their young one. Right? The daughter of my people. Is that the daughters of my people? The Israelites. The is, is become cruel. They become cruel, right? Hatred amongst their own people. Go ahead. Like the ostrich in the wilderness. Right, you know what an ostrich looks like, right? That neck kind of sticking up like this, high, high up in the air. Stiff neck over here like this. Right. Nobody else moves like that other than our women on the highest level. That's right. That's the whole point. We're digging into the Bible and seeing our history. Let me get that. This is the book of Sarah, chapter 24 and verse 23. Yeah. Oh, all these things are the book of the covenant of the Most High God. What's a covenant? Uh -huh. It's like a contract. Okay. Right? It's a book of the covenant, a contract that the Israelites made with the Lord. Go ahead. Even the law which Moses commanded for inheritance. Right? For a heritage. A heritage is something that's passed down onto you. Right. So these curses were passed down unto us. That's why on a high level we're going through these things. Right. So this is a heritage. In the culture of the Israelites, and that's happening to us now, what would that make us? Uh, I guess slaves. Who were the slaves of? Um, I think they were the Israelites. They were the Israelites. Yeah. Right. You right. understand? Uh, so the slaves in the Bible were the Israelites. Yeah. The slaves were the ones that going through the curses of the Israelites. And it's happening to the so-called black man, just as it's happening to the Israelites in the Bible. Who would the so-called black and brown people be? Come on, brother. It started with an I. Israelite. Israelite. Right. But I was kind of stuck when we were talking about earlier what you said about what's happening to women. Because I've been paying attention to this too. All right. I feel like I agree with what you're saying. Yeah. What's happening to the women in our community, it is mainly it is happening in our community the most because our community is it's more what you call gynocentric. But I feel like what you're talking about with the women thinking that they're equal to the man, that's happening all over. Because you got all this nonsense being pushed in schools about, I'm you know, not girls and stuff. Not happening I mean, all over. Yeah. I'm saying on percentage wise, mm -hmm. uh, 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 ecosystem wise, as far as ecosystem within uh, people, yeah, mankind, yeah. when you dumb it all the way down, it's only a certain group. And yeah. it tends to point to the so called minority group. Yeah. That's fractured. Right. right? And like, oh, uh, my God. Niggas always wondering why these why these no, act the way they act. It's like you don't you don't check. Like I feel like we, I feel like you know to the tenth verse twelve. Bring it out. Oh my God. And now Israel. Right. And now Israel. Who the Israelites? Black. Right. What's your nationality, Chase? What's your nationality? Uh, black and Irish. Black and Irish. What's your father? Black. So called black man, right? So your practical lineage is what counts for the seed line. You understand? I'm gonna show you that real quick. You believe in the Bible? Believe in it? Yeah. Uh, but I, that's, a, that's, a, that's a major question. So, uh, yes or no, no? It's, it's really not a yes or no. Why is, why is it a yes or no? I got it, bro. I got it, bro. Do it. Ezra 22. Real quick, do I follow the Bible? Ezra No. No, I don't follow the Bible. Yeah, I'm I believe the Bible is a real thing. It was a book, right? It was written a long time ago. It's got a lot of good stuff in there. Right? Like, I, I, I was brought up in a, in a, in a, in a generally Christian Christ background, right? Like our society is, is, is constructed around a lot of Christian values right. and it touches just about everything that we do, right? So, in, and in general, most religions take from the same principles and moral teachings, right? And, and I think it's, it's, and it's, all, it's all good stuff. I'm going to show you real quick because that's fact. I 100% agree with that. There's no dispute from my mouth with that statement. But we got to understand who are they taking it from. Go ahead. This is the book of Sirach, chapter 24 and verse 23. Bring it out. All these things are the book of the covenant. So a covenant, just like I explained to him, is a contract. You understand? You make a covenant with somebody, you're making a contract with them. Oh, go ahead. Of the most high God. So with the most high, go ahead. Even the law which Moses commanded for inheritance unto the congregation of Jacob. Of Jacob. So do you know about Moses, right? Who did he give the law to? Who did Moses give the law to? That I don't know. All right, let me get Deuteronomy 29 and 1. All right? He said he gave it to the congregation of Jacob. 
But to put it on layman's terms, we're gonna find out who the congregation of Jacob is. Right? It's the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 29, and verse 1. Right. These are the words of the covenant, right? Which the Lord commanded Moses, right? To make with the children of Israel. To make with the children of Israel. You understand? Now, Moses made that covenant as an inheritance. So an inheritance isn't something that you kind of just grab from the side of the street. You hear in the churches, that's not that's not what it is. An inheritance is something that's passed down to you. So the thing is, just like you said, all these religions took from a common source. But their common source was the history and inheritance of the Israelites. Right. That's what's key. The Christian church is going to tell you that. You understand? Because that's how they get their funds. That's how they get their, uh, 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 what is it? Their high, um, mm -hmm. their high fame and fortune. You understand? They get it off of the basis of that. Right. So right. that's why they have to take this. We're going to get... Um, you you um, mind if I interject? Um, for what? I don't completely agree that they took it. I feel like it's more... I'm going to show you that. Let me get Deuteronomy 7 and 3. Real quick, real quick. Two things. I'm going to just give you two precepts. Two precepts. Two lines, bro. This is the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 7, and verse 6. Get out. For thou art an holy people right. unto the Lord thy God. Go the Lord thy God hath chosen thee uh, to be a special people unto himself. Right. Above all people. It says what? Above, above all people. people. So, do Christians see that? Wait, I'm sorry. Read that again. This is the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 7, and verse 6. Go ahead. For thou art an holy people. Holy. That means set apart. Go ahead. Unto the Lord thy God. Right. The Lord thy God hath chosen thee right. to be a special people unto himself. Right. Above all people. That's what I asked. Do the Christians teach that? No, I don't think ahead. it's more of like we're all one of us. Right. But th is that what the Lord said? No. Right. So that's what I'm saying. Their entire concept, they had to orchestrate around their ideology. Yeah, they wanted to make this more utopian mindset of everybody that, at once. Yeah. That are upon the face of the earth. So if the Israelites are above all people, you not say that. what would our people be? Huh? If the Lord said that the Israelites are above all people, uh -huh. and we are the Israelites, what would that make us? We're on top. We're on top. Yeah. Exactly. But can I say but, that? Um, go ahead real quick. Buddy. The idea that we're all one people under God, I feel like that's a better message because it unifies people. Because you know, but, people need a sense of... People, I feel like people, and this is why I kind of like America. Like when I think of America, I think of America the way it was in the 90s. Like I feel like the 90s were the best. Because like everybody was different. Everybody had their own beliefs and ideas. But we came up together on a one it. identity. Like the reason why we have issues nowadays is because but people can't. don't have a one unifying can't. identity. The we thing is, some, uh, identity we, we agree with unification. Look at the yeah. brothers out here. Right? You see the brothers out here. Right. We agree with unification. But you have to have unification. What the Lord said. You understand? I don't. Let me I'll get a honest, precept. I don't. I don't. I don't think you guys need to because um I saw a video. You're gonna I get a precept, huh? I'm gonna get a Bible verse to back up what I'm saying because I can't just say it without proving. Okay. You feel right. what I'm saying? Okay. Oh, no, no, no. I'm, I'm trying okay. to move. I'm about to go in a few minutes. I'm gonna listen to you. This is the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 32 and verse 8. When the Most High divided the nation. What did he do? When he divided the nation. So did the Lord want unification or did he divide the nation? He divided, he divided the nation. Right? Go ahead. Because he knew that. Everybody. Their inheritance. Right. When he separated the sons of Adam. And he separated the sons of Adam. You understand? Go ahead. He set the bounds of the people according to to the number of the children of Israel. According to the children of, uh, of Israel. That's so right. you do see the unification, but the unification is among our people, the Israelites. Right. So that's what the Lord established. That's what the Lord ordained. Do you understand? So you probably did see a video where brothers kind of coming at probably, you know, well, East Indian, so white video, man, they do. I saw a video with one of you guys. I don't know if you guys did it. Be, huh. But someone had a white guy come over here and kiss their feet. I don't agree with that. I don't think that helps people. Let me get it. Like, let me get it. I'm gonna make it plain. I'm gonna make it plain. I don't agree with that. I don't think you guys agree with that, but I don't like that. I feel like that's a good I push people further away. Let me get Proverbs 20 24. We don't force them. We don't come, come over here and, and push them. Well, you didn't force them. I'm not saying you didn't force them. We don't do that. It's the words of the Lord. It's the words of the Lord. Right. 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 We had a brother, I lied not. We had witnesses. Yeah. We had, it was a Edomite, a yeah. so-called white man. Yeah. Came from up the street, walked up, nobody said nothing to him. 
came and kissed every brother's shoe and walked up. Nobody told we didn't pull out no precepts right. for him. You understand? That's the Lord. Come look at that. I'm gonna be real. That's just the Lord. The skeptical side of me kind of thinks that was a stage. Like I'm aware, the skeptical side of me believes that's kind of stage because like stage. Yeah, like shit like yeah, that happens. Right, I mean, right, I'm right. not paying my brother to stand out here. Uh, 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 are we getting paid to stay out here? Uh, 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 then that brother get paid to sit here and listen. Did we pay you to listen? No, let me finish. You guys had the reaction going on with the seats and the necklaces and the um. Brother, I just told you in the Bible that we was taking ornaments. Yeah, the gold, silver, the costumes. What? You know, that was the theatrics back then. They was literally doing that. I mean, I don't know. We're taking over the customs of our forefathers. Well, you can't say because that's a book with my band. It's a book. You never know. Like, so, brother, you just don't believe in the Bible. No, I don't. I think I think it's intended for us. I think the Bible has the point, but I don't believe in the Bible. Well, I think the Bible has the point because the book. So the thing is, first and foremost, you agree. Guidance. You agree with everything that was brought out, but okay. you don't believe in the Bible. I agree with almost everything. I agree that there are issues with the, with the black community in terms of having an identity, in terms of separating ourselves from the white man. I think the problem is as much as white people talk about how they hate the white man, how oh the white man is the bad guy. He, uh, we love the white man to the point where we all take his money. We take his money. We Brother, take we his showed food. you that. We take his, I we agree. showed yeah. you why, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. I agree with and that. And if this book is only that. talking about our people, that is simply well, it was saying that our guy God was your point of view. Like, yeah. it was written by somebody with a bias. I don't know that. With a bias? Yeah, probably. These were Israelites. Right. I mean, who, I, yo, who is, who's Moses? I don't know. He's an Israelite. Right. right. Who's Isaiah? Right. He's an Israelite. Right. Who's Jeremiah? John. Matthew. Right. Wake him up. Wake him up. Well, He's an Israelite, brother. You know, so the thing is, I don't really do that. I don't really do my part of that. Like, this is what I'm talking about when it comes to unification, because when it all when it all said to them, when we don't have something that brings us together, we resort to this very tribalistic mindset. Like, oh, I'm an Israelite. Oh, I'm a Christian. Oh, I'm this, that, and the third. It was like, we're all people. That's why I said we're all different shades of orange, because we are all different shades of people. Like, we're all different, but we're different. Well, brother, the spirit already kind of compelled you. You understood at first, and you kind of kind of yeah. didn't get it. You got Mark. I don't agree with the mindset. All right, you got that. You can get that. Let me get Mark to the floor. You got that. Let me get Mark to the floor. 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 Let me get Mark to that's literally what happened. Well, you got indoctrinated. I'm gonna explain it King, to you. But King, 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 I'm about to go quick. in a few minutes. I'm right, say but this. I was in the midst of speaking. You I want to say this. I, I'm right, but I'm in the midst of speaking. Okay, you know what I'm saying? What happened was you got indoctrinated to the point where you don't believe in the words of the Lord. Right. To the point where you look at this and think it was just written by mortal. Uh, as far as mortal, I'm talking about uh, 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 fleshly men. Right. As far as not after the spirit of the Most High God. Right. Go ahead. Into a lie and worship and serve the creature more than the creator. Because anything outside of the creator is vanity. You understand? It's vanity. Well, Go man, ahead. Who is blessed forever. Amen. This. For this cause, Yahweh gave them up unto violent affections. Right. For even their women, they changed the natural no, that's, use. That's it on okay, can I, can I say what I'm about to say? Because I'm about to leave in a few All minutes. Right. And now All I got right. another piece of food. Um, so. 15. It's the book yeah, of yeah. Go ahead, go ahead. I agree with what you're saying. I agree, you well, know. I'm not I don't, saying it, brother. No, I'm hang on. Let me let me finish. Go ahead. It's the book of Mark, chapter 4, that, verse 15. And these are they by the way, no, son. Verse 16. Verse 16. And these are they, likewise, which are sown on stony ground. Right. Who, when they have heard the word, immediately receive it with gladness. At first, you receive the word with gladness. You was like, wow. Yeah, I agree with you, but I'm trying to divulge when it comes to the whole black people or the special groups. You know what? Let me think. You know what's funny to me about what you're saying? It's not no root in themselves. And so would you. Brother, you didn't have any root in yourself. If you went through the Bible, you wouldn't understand what you just said. The white man doesn't say the same thing. Because the Bible says that they're the devil that the Bible speaks of. They're the wicked of the earth. They say that the so-called black Latino the name of that's exactly the same thing. Show me, show me right now. Pull it up. You got a phone. Pull it up. Pull it up. Let me see a video. 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 Let me see a video.
The shit that goes on in the news. These, you know, these flash mobs that go around these cities with niggas running around stealing from stores, right? Notice how the news they like was with your soul was Stony Grill. Who? They have heard the word immediately received it with glad and had no reason to be mad. Now you gotta get the fuck out of here. Now you gotta get the fuck out of here. Now you gotta get the fuck out of here. Now you gotta get the fuck out of here. Now you gotta get the fuck out of here. Now you gotta get the fuck out of here. Now you gotta get the fuck out of here. Now you gotta get the fuck out of here. Now you gotta get the fuck out of here. Now you gotta get the fuck out of here. Now you gotta get the fuck out of here. You don't let me finish. Like, I, I listen to what you said. My dude, my dude, I listen to what you said. Afterward, when affliction or persecution arises, for the word's sake. I don't know what persecution came across you. You know, but I think the script is kind of. My dude, my dude, my dude. My dude, I listen to what you said. Hang on, hang on. I listen to what you said. Immediately, they are offended. I'm about to leave in a minute. You got offended by the words of the Lord. I'm not offended. It's worth it. You're not letting me speak. You're not letting me explain myself. I'm not offended. I'm not upset. You're not letting me explain yeah, myself. Let me explain. Go ahead, brother. What you're talking about, you. what you're talking about right now, of uh, black people being this, black people, Native Americans, Indians, being a part of this high class of people, that's the same shit that these white people are saying. Because you got, like, a good example of that. You got these niggas talking about how the Native Americans, I brought this up in the beginning, how the Native Americans are people, people how they were this, that, and the third. Those niggas were violent. The reason why they lost in the war up over America is because they didn't have weapons. They didn't have guns. Who they did? Have, Native Americans. They had shit. That's why they lost. Wow. Like this shit now. So you know about the Seminole? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Because now I gotta correct you. Now I gotta correct you. Do you know about the Seminole Indians? Do you know about the Seminole Indians? Hold on. Do you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on. Did you know about the Seminole Wars? Hold on.
enemies of our nation, man. Right. You are not the so-called black, Latino, and native Seminole Indian. You are a heathen. You are disgusting. Right. You are abominable. Right. You are like it unto spittle. Right. And the Lord's going to destroy you. That's right. 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 Make the time short. Right. Remember the covenant. Remember the covenant. That's what we're pleading for. Jump to verse 11. Verse 11. Gather all the tribes of Jacob. It said what? Gather all the tribes of Jacob. What did you say? Gather all the tribes of Jacob. Gather all the tribes of Jacob. Together and inherit our end as from the beginning. As from the beginning. And with that, all praise to the Most High for a beautiful, beautiful feast day in the Spirit of the Lord. Call me, Mr. Call me, Mr.